Hi, what's up guys? Welcome to a new video of Odoo 10 tutorial. Today we are going to learn how to use scaffold, which is a smart command to create the template of Odoo modules. Okay, let's start with opening our terminal. And moving to Udo folder, okay, and running the Udo pin scaffold dash help. Using help, we will get more details about scaffold. Okay, it takes a few minutes. Okay, it's here now. Okay, this is how to use scaffold dash h the parameter dash h is to show this help message and exit that's exactly what we have done dash t template we have two options of the templates one of them is the default and the other is, is theme we are going to use both of them and the final is the name of the module and the destination and it it, it destination is so satisfies where will you uh, locate your module okay so let's start to moving out of Udo now we have only Udo we let's start with creating uh, the folder where well we create our custom modules make dire is a well-known well-known uh, Linux command to create folders Okay, and now we have Udo and custom modules. I'm running Udo dash bin with a scaffold. Okay, using this guide, we have scaffold dash t default. Actually, it's default. We can we can avoid writing this comment so that it can be scaffold and the name of the module only let's say test scaffold and the destination should be our custom folder or custom modules folder and here we are i will list custom modules we have test scaffold which is an udo module As you can see, we have control controllers. I'm sorry, we have controllers. Demo, init.py, manifest.py. Manifest.py uh, is replacing uh, uh, openrp.py and models security views. We are we will go through all of these uh, in a separate uh, lecture. Okay, let's let us use the other template. which is theme as you can see here I will name it test theme scaffold also I will locate it in custom modules okay let us see how will it work for us okay we have demo n.py manifest static and views as it it's this uh, this command or this template is for new themes for Odoo. So we have static for uh, JS or JavaScript files and CSS file cascaded uh, style sheets and also the views to create new themes. Okay, we can we can conclude that scaffold is a smart command to create and also to save your time to create uh, uh, Odoo modules. In a standard way, so that all the developers or or you all of or your team can uh, figure out where are your files located easily. They can find all .py files or models files here in uh, models. Also XML files here and views. 
if you have any demo files which is required or let's say recommended not it's not required actually it's it's recommended to have demo files okay it would be here and demo files also if you have any uh, logical related to the front end or the website it will be located here on in controllers that it make it easy for you and your team to find files or to find uh, the logic you have written for for uh, your module thank you for watching